I want a lot for Christmas, but uh, this is a kind of a personal piece. Can't change the past, although I wish I could. So I'm breaking down the gas inside this wood. Hope I elevate to better days. I pray. Hope I elevate to better days. I pray. Oh, I can't change the past, although I wish I could. So I'm breaking down the gas inside this wood. Hope I elevate to better days. I pray. Hope I elevate to better days. I pray. Oh, I. Light another. I missed them days when my brother used to be me, him, and mother, one bedroom, but had three covers. Kitchen was flooded with dishes. Mama would come home switching job to job with no nigga or fake cool father figure. Uh, daddy, she's done depiction of. Mama, she couldn't be with two boys making noise. What a mess, breaking toys, trying to flex, trying to buck, talking back, acting tough. You can smack, now that's enough. Yeah. I told you, don't make me hurt you. Wouldn't beat you without a purpose, but it's like y'all do shit on purpose to get me y'all riding worked up. I'm busting three freaking job at the time just to be broke so glad you think it's a joke boy you better wipe that smile up off your face before i choke i don't do this for my health i do it because there's no help so if you learn nothing else then learn to do it yourself because people are fickle creatures they'll slither right in your life smiling while they greet you but really there to defeat you i know it seems like i'm hard on you but i gotta be honestly if i had to do it all over again and i probably would have passed on your daddy and wouldn't have to deal with smart mouth little bastards who have yet to see the real you can smirk and play while i work to pay the bills i sweat bleed and cry so you don't have to know how it feels to be struggling with kids and have no time to chill I'm up to my neck in debt, past due on the lights, trying to feed you ungrateful fools, but all you want to do is fight and point fingers, trash my house and don't clean up. But I know when I get back, them dishes better be done, and that room better be clean. Don't too much care about you thinking I mean, because if the stuff ain't done like I told you, I'm going to show you a side of me you've never seen. The door slams, and that was our daily devotion. As she was clocking out to clock in, we were supposed to be focused on what had been instructed but didn't notice the destruction we'd molded. Through tearing up the kitchen and leaving clothes on the floor unfolded and dirty, unworthy of any wants, but had exactly what we needed. Birthday parties and loads of gifts under the Christmas tree, very scarce when it happened, but shit, that's how it be. Of course, then it all seemed difficult and unfair, but the cards life dealt had to be played in the finesse. Like winning with a ten or less, trying to turn the worst to the best, imitating joy through distress. It's tough, yes, but moms handled it with grace. In the face of tribulation, she was fixated on making sure she provided despite the situation. Now the roles are reversed. I've dispersed the seed into a woman who I hurt and had no intention on being. Faced with demons of leaving because of what my pops did previous, but trying to hold on to the things that moms was preaching. You, either raised, you were either raised on love or taught how to survive. And you can tell one from another because of the world that's viewed in each eye. It's different. Like as long as I provide and spend a little time, she'll be happy. And I'll be fine. She's smiling without a worry in mind, which is cool now because she's too young to understand. The difference between being a boy who's a daddy and a daddy that's a man. What if she knew I was a single man living a double life, claimed to be a whole father who's really a part-time daddy, half together, workaholic, pot head that dances and prances on the altar like he's been called by God himself, who also prides himself on the fact that he pays child support, but shows a lack of support for anything else. At least that's how it seems. Steady chasing a dream with no conviction, conditioned to fail but positioned to win. If you listen to when moms was lecturing, these things were said to help and steer you into the right. Use your struggle as a guiding light to know right from wrong. And if things change and adapt, why do the world's job for you and beat yourself up? Your daughter sees a hero, regardless of what you have to put up. You're not your father, and you weren't born to be a mother. God gave you a specific gift that he could give no other. So take a breath, have a seat. Storms don't last always, and he wouldn't challenge you if you were weak.